Oh, hello, everyone. <laughs> Alright, let's hope this one goes better. Nurse. How'd you know I was there? Holy shit. I lost her. For now, anyway. Cool. Oh, she found someone else. <laughs> so I probably didn't lose her. I just got lucky. Sounds like she might not be a great nurse, so... Where's another generator? Fuck. <laughs> it depends on the nurse. <laughs> Hello, Nia. Let's do this together. <clears throat> I don't know where she is. Whoever that extravagant hunt person is got away. I guess. Or the chase is still going on. Oh, the killer found that guy. So we're actually going to go over there and take the gin from him. Let's go heal her, actually. We'll come back for the gin. We want to remove that stack of thanatophobia. Let me heal you, Nia. Thank you, girl. Cool, cool, cool. One less stack of thanatophobia. Let's run into the house now where that gin was. That Nia ran somewhere else. And that Nia is just hanging out. So I can use that vault to escape if the killer comes this way. Nope, oh, that David looks like he's getting chased. He's run off. We'll keep working this gin, though. It's only one stack of thanatophobia, so I think it's only like a 6% decrease in action speed. A gin takes 80 seconds, so 6% isn't even 8 seconds longer, so it's not a big deal. Hey, girl. Oh, she got me. She's at least good enough to know how to time that. Yoinks. No, we did not get away. She's going to hit me now. <laughs> That's the problem with being sneaky, is if you fail to be sneaky, you get punished for it. Okay. It's our first hook, though. We got two gens done. Three gens done. And there's someone on that one. Oh, it looks like the killer might have found her though. Found him though. Just heal me here. The nurse is chasing someone. And there's two of you. Okay. I think there's a gin back here. Am I wrong? Yeah, it looks like I'm wrong. They must all be on that side of the map then. We might have made a mistake with our gen completion. Well, I know there was a person working on one back here. It wasn't this one, so it must be over here. In the killer shack, maybe? Yeah, that was the one that other person was on. Of course, I bring a flashlight and it's nurse. It's really hard to use the flashlight effectively against nurse. Oh, you know what? She can't blink when she has the flashlight on her, right? So maybe that's one thing you can do. She's nearby. 
Sounds like she's chasing someone else, so we'll just keep working. Is this guy needing healing near me? Hey. Hello, Jacob. Alright. So we'll get him healed up and we'll go back to that generator. We'll have no Thanatophobia stacks after that, so... She's over by this gen. Thank God she didn't look over here. She thought we went back onto the generator. She's still looking around. Okay, thank God. She dipped out, so let's go back to the gin. She might blink right back, so we have to be ready to dip. She did, she did. I was right. Ah, fuck. Oh my god. Okay, well, we're down again. Man. I'm not playing very good tonight. I'm sorry, gang. Might be an off night for me. I might need to take a break. I could have played that better. I, I'm trying to be sneaky, and I need to just run. Like, I know I played that bad. I could, I am already seeing all of the ways I could have played that better, but instead I just tried to be sneaky. I think I just got used to playing against killers who aren't great, and so being sneaky works, but when killers are good, being sneaky is not a good thing to do. Because as you can see, if I'm crouching and trying to be sneaky and they know I am, they'll just catch me anyway, and there's no way you can get away. It's more important to create distance. We're just going to YOLO this generator down. You want me to go? Oh, you want me to leave? Okay. Okay, I'm getting healed. Jake's breaking a doll totem. The killer shack generator has a bunch of progress on it, so hopefully we can finish that. Maybe we'll still get out of here alive. Despite my misplays. She only has two blinks, so every time we hear the second blink, we definitely have a few seconds. Sick. Oh, and that person being chased had adrenaline. Very good. So we gave her an extra hit, and we'll run over here and grab this generator. Now she can just, oh, I was going to say, she can just blink over here very fast, so we have to be wary. But she's carrying someone, so we should be able to finish this gate now. Okay, we're not going to enter the gate yet, though, just in case we need to do some shenanigans to save this person. Never go in the gate unless you want to leave, because the killer can force you to leave if you walk into the gate. Oh, does she have barbecue? She knew, like, exactly where I was. I need to stop running, because it looks like she's still looking for me. She saw me. And so here I am being sneaky again, and it's dumb. I need to run. Okay, let's jet ourselves back to the gate we were at. Huh. <laughs> I just did that stopper in case she didn't blink over, which she didn't, so lucky. Missed me. Okay, we still escape. Oh no, our friend. 
Oh my god, the killer had no one escapes death. We were playing with fucking fire that whole time. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> okay, well, we got out alive. Maybe we shouldn't have, but we did. <laughs> GG. And we pipped. Lots of benevolence. We got out alive. And then we didn't, didn't do very well in the other two categories, but we did well enough. Let's make sure they escape. Oh, they did. What'd she have? The Notophobia, Devour Hope, Nurses Calling, and Barbecue. She did not have No One Escapes Dead. She had Devour Hope. She had a longer blink range and blinked faster.